Goa, a prime tourist destination which gets its major revenue from the tourism industry, has received terror warnings from the United Nations and Intelligence Bureau officials, which has put a question mark on the strategy of the state's home and tourism ministries to safeguard this vital sector. Goa was put on high alert during the past week, although the state police officials have declined to comment on what specific measures have been taken in view of the threat perception. Sources have revealed that as per the latest intelligence report, the Pakistan-based terror group lashkar e taiba is eyeing the important establishments such as Kandla and Mundra ports and the Jamnagar refinery in Gujarat, the Tarapur Atomic Power Station and Baba Atomic Research Centre in Maharashtra are also said to be on the radar of lashkar e taiba which also includes Goa. Speaking to Goa 365, Home Minister Ravi Naik said that he did not feel that there was any such terror threat to Goa. Nevertheless, he said security in the state has already been tightened. No, I am not sure that the government has tightened the security and it continues to be tightened. All sensitive things are sensitive things. We have police force and security. Now, CID, the coastal landing, the police security, so the police is very sensitive, the police is very sensitive, the water is very sensitive, the police is very sensitive, and the police force is very sensitive. Speaking to Goa 365, officer on special duty to the tourism minister, Lyndon Montero, said that whenever the state had received such inputs of security threat in the past, adequate measures had been taken. He said there was no need to panic as these were mere inputs provided by the central intelligence agencies to the state government to be alert. He said the tourism department was working in tandem with the home ministry to prevent any terror-related incident in the state. We must understand that whenever any inputs about uh, security threat and uh, threat to the state comes, these, uh, one need not get uh, panic. These are always uh, inputs that are confidentially given to the state government by the center uh, so that the state is alert in case of any eventuality. As far as uh, the state of Goa is concerned, we have always said and we, I continue to say that the state of Goa is safe and secure. There is no need to panic. The, the tourism department has been working through the home ministry and the home ministry of Goa is fully prepared to tackle any eventuality. In fact, a lot of preventive measures have already been taken by the uh, department of uh, home and they are from time to time taking newer measures to make sure that all the citizens of Goa as well as all the visiting tourists and, uh, and the guests of uh, Goa are safe enough. When asked how the coastal area was being secured by the state tourism ministry in view of such terror alerts, Linden said the coastal and other police machinery has already been alerted to secure the coastal and other areas in the state. The Home Ministry from time to time, as I have said earlier, is taking various measures. We have the coastal police, we have uh, 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 the other police machinery and uh, the Home Department has got its uh, uh, various other uh, measures and um, facilities to ensure that not just the coastal areas of Goa but the entire state of Goa is safe and secure.